Hello YouTube, Sucker Fox here. Now this is uh, the first in um, a series of PCW tutorial videos. Just to uh, let people who've got one of these Amstrad PCW 8256 or 8512s uh, get started really. So this is one of the basic things you're going to be doing, which is loading the CPM disk, which is the operating system, which stands for Control Program for Microcomputers, sort of a pre-DOS uh, standard system. And every PCW came with one of these disks, so the first thing you're going to want to, going to, want to do is make a copy of it. And you'll be wanting to copy lots of disks as well in the future as backups. So you put your CPM master disk in. Type disk kit like that. And enter. Now when you want to copy to a blank disk, the first thing you're going to want to do is format the disk. So, let's remove our CPM master, master disk. Right, so you've got some options here. Copy, format, verify. So, we've got a blank 3 inch disk there. Make sure the holes are white. The holes there. White to right. And put side 1 in, let's format it, F3, F4 to format, and again, format in A because that's the top drive, I've actually got two drives in this computer, press Y, and it'll start formatting it, counting up there, and it'll count up till it gets to 39. Right, so I've just skipped a bit there, we've got to 39 and the format is complete. So, the next thing you want to do is make a copy. So you want to press F5, F6 and the disk you want to read from in disk drive A. Now if you've just got a single drive, you'll obviously just copy it over into the computer's memory, the M drive, and then put the disk you want to write to in disk drive A, but because I've got two drives, I might better copy to B. I'm not sure, I might have to do it all in A. Let's have a look. So let's read from disk in drive A F3, F4, now I've put in a game called Colossal Cave Adventure, but you could use the original CPM disk you want to make a copy of or any other disk you want. So it's reading from the disk in drive A, my colossal cave adventure game, just a text based adventure. And once again, it's going to count up to 39 because there's 39 tracks on the disk, the actual CD like disk that's inside the outer plastic housing. Right, so that's worked. Insert the disk you want to write to. So that is in. Press any key, and once again it will write the tracks 1 to 39. Make a perfect copy of the disk. So this disk kit comes with the CPM program. It's like a little bonus really, the operating system. Built in disk copying software, which is really useful. You can get other programs that will help you copy other disks that are protected, like some games are protected and you'll need specialist programs to copy them to get past the copy protection. But for everyday disks like program disks and some basic games this uh, disk kit works fine. So there we go. Copy complete. Remove your copy and press any key kit to get back to the menu. And when you're finished just exit and that'll take you out to CPM. So Let's see if our copy's worked. So you can see what is on any disk by typing in DIR and pressing return. So there we go, there's all the uh, there's all the programs are on it, so let's just try and load it. Advent 2. Anything uh, com, that's the that's the way you load it usually at the top left, so if you're missing the instructions, you don't know how to load an Amstrad PCW game, just type DIR 
it'll list what's on the disk and find the com somewhere near the top left and press enter and that's loading away so it looks as if that's made a perfect copy of the original there we go escape from arg it's called some reason, although on the disc it says Colossal Cave Adventure. So, you've got a load of instructions. View in a small clearing to north is a cave entrance. It's one of them games, text-based adventure. So yeah, that's just how you make a copy. I hope that's uh, of some use. Thanks for watching.